is up everyone and welcome back to another Animus unboxing and today we're going to be unboxing the Barbatos Rex Swallowtail. Let's get right to it. So in this video I decided to do something a little bit different. I know that I've already done an in-depth review of the Swallowtail so I decided to just, just do an unboxing of the new Barbatos Rex collaboration with Gallery, the Swallowtail. So I received this today in the mail. Um, biggest thing that I want you to, to know is that these came in also bundles which also included like a fan uh, attachment for the uh, nozzle as well as a stand right which was enumerated it was limited to 300 right so uh, i did order all those things as well however gallery did tell me that they were having some logistic problems and that it was going to be delayed i believe barbatos also announced it in the uh in his channel super glad that gallery sent this ahead of time um, but still waiting on the other items. So unfortunately those will have to be reviewed on it at another time So let's go ahead and get started. So as you can see the box is completely sealed. I have not opened it whatsoever I got it in the mail. It, it came in like a plastic bag. So I just took the bag out You can see it's got like little, you know mail carrier damage there uh, Which is always great and then um, but let's go ahead and open it up and see the inside So I can at least say that it's all that is packaged out of the quickly, right? So uh, let's look, go ahead and take it out the box. So out of the box is very packed well. I love the fact that they also did the blue on the box. Now, if you guys remember the box for the swallowtail, the box for the swallowtail had the uh, emblem for the butterfly. It had it on in uh, red, and then this one's in blue. So I'm actually super hyped about that. You have the gallery and Barbatos Rex with his whole mecha empire. Uh, insignia right there which is also awesome as well it's also great you have it on the side which is great and then you have everything on the back which is the same standard as the one with the uh, swallowtail for studio g however this one is um is for barbatos rex right so you got the gallery on this side so opening up the box right here you have the same diagram as you did whenever you bought the other swallowtail um which is always great like i mentioned before this is super handy for everyone especially beginners that don't really know how to take out uh, you know take apart an airbrush this is super helpful um as you can see they changed the in the diagram they changed the color of the trigger itself they added the barbatos rex at the bottom which is great um here you have the envelope same as the other one is standard in red it's going to be in blue actually it looks like a purple some a type of purple blue which is always great um You'll have the letter from the gallery team like the last time, and then you'll have the instructions there as well. So, like I mentioned before, you know, this is just gonna be a short unboxing considering I've already made a review of this, um, uh, of in-depth review of a swallowtail without any issues. Uh, so that way, you know, everybody can see what's going on there. Uh, now, I know what everybody's saying. Will it work out of box? Well, we're about to find out here. Uh, I'm definitely gonna try and do a little couple of spray tests to see uh, if, it's, if it's working adequately and then we'll go from there. Um, like I mentioned before, this is pretty standard that like we saw with the other uh, Swallowtail, you'll get the O-rings, which is gray, you'll get the lube, you'll get both the nozzles, the 0.5 and the 0.7. You will also get both the needles, the 0.5 and the 0.7. You'll get both the tanks and then the swallowtail itself, right? So I just can't get over how nice these swallowtails look. It's even the other ones, they, they look super nice. Um, and this one has zero issues out of the box when pulling the trigger. This is terrific. Oh my God, it feels so smooth. So you go ahead, let's go ahead and give it the, the good old wall try, right? So uh, pull to the wall and smooth back, get to the wall, release. Perfect. This is awesome. Uh, I'm already excited. You got the, the you get the co-otters, you get the gallery with Barbatos Rex on the airbrush itself. Um, very, very um, excited to use this. We'll go ahead and give it a try. Like I said, everybody meant, it always says, well, will it work out of box? We're about to find out. I can already check the box on, tri on the trigger. Trigger is excellent no issues there now let's go ahead and try it out Right, everyone. 
everyone so welcome back so as you saw in that video no issues when i did the functions check on this one it was terrific um i can't wait to use this one like i was mentioning before i was waiting i was waiting to see if i could get one so i could use it with a 0.7 millimeter uh, needle that's what i'm gonna use this one for so um, we're gonna go ahead and slap the big tank on there and then use it for priming and everything like that so super excited to use this one like i was mentioning before this was just gonna be a short video uh just to show you guys um it does look like it's a blue purple like a blue purple type of look i actually like this a lot um let me see something so usually when colors like this oh so it's not uv <laughs> it's not uv reactive which would have been insane um but yeah it's I definitely like this I definitely like this color pattern on this one um definitely gonna enjoy it give it a run for that money so definitely want to congratulate barbatos on his uh partnership with uh, gallery to release this product here uh, it's a really good product this one like I was saying before my worry was that I was gonna have the same out-of-box issues like I did with the uh, with the studio G one however had zero issues out of the box this is a win uh, so now some of you asked me about doing a comparison side by side with the uh, swallowtail for studio G and this is this is how it looked like side to side the only difference that I have here is that the uh, the Studio G1 has the bigger tank and then from what I can see just just in the body the only difference is gonna be the tip and the back as you can see the uh, the knob the little knob um, has the gray has the silver instead of the red uh, which I believe it, gi it gives it that subtleness as well so um, both great products I mean I'm using them both yeah it's the same it's the same airbrush for with another collab however one didn't give me issues out of box same as the second uh, swallowtail that I got from Studio G uh, and I'm super excited to have these in my arsenal to paint so uh, shout out to gallery for all for you know like I said being a big supporter of this channel um, and if you guys have any comments any questions any comparisons let me know did you guys get your swallowtails did you guys um, did you guys get any other airbrushes? Did you have any issues? Do you like them? Tell me how's it been going for you. Uh, like I was mentioning before in my previous video, uh, one of these, one of the biggest things in in uh, this community, at least the painting community, is that uh, having that support from uh, companies like Gallery that will um, will always have that exemplary customer service in regards to any issues that you might have. Um, I love the fact that even though the um, the you know the cap and the stand were delayed they still send me the airbrush ahead of time uh that's definitely something that i can that i can you know definitely stand behind so uh thank you so much for watching you guys uh stay tuned for the next video which we will be we will be releasing the uh zaku build video uh that build is almost done with we've had a little bit of delay so you know with the new air spray booth coming in and everything so um but hopefully i can get that video out to you guys soon enough so Thank you so much for watching. See you guys next time.